Alright, this is the Channel Vision uh, UHF uh, tuner. What this device does is it allows you to ha select two UHF channels. It's essentially it's a uh, RF modulator for UHF channels. So it'll allow you to send a channel UHF um, two UHF channels to uh, throughout your uh, if you have like an antenna and you can send it through your system so that you could have um, different devices playing it. For example, what I have right here, I just have this uh, HomeWorks uh, over the air TV tuner. It actually plays MKVs and uh, MP4 files off this flash drive. So what I do is just have that loop over and over again, sending a uh, sending videos, and I just have it in a repetitive loop. So A through Z, uh, and numerically, um, and uh, same exact thing with this device here, which is a Raspberry Pi computer, a very small, old, tiny computer, just uh, with a little USB stick coming out of it. I just use for this. I just use the um, composite output because uh, the channel channel vision device here just takes composite video. I don't have stereo plugged into one of the channels but I don't really need it so you just have a cable output here as you can see and what it does is it goes pretty much to this mess of wires down here. Let me see if I can show you. There's that splitter down there with that gray cable coming out of it. It's going from that and I think what I'm using that is a Instead of a splitter um, that you just use at a get it from a hardware store, I'm using it as a mixer. So it's um, taking that and the antenna, uh, and also uh, I have a satellite uh, receiver RF output. So it just ch sends that as in channel three. So I have three channels coming out of this, going through this, broadcasting, and then I have the antenna mixing and going to the other TVs in the house. And there's another splitter just splitting it up. Anyway, that's just a real mess of wires. So that's a neat little way to, uh, if you want to have your own closed circuit cable system, uh, or if you want, to, you could even run security cameras with this type setup. I'm just using this for my parents. I have it at my home right now, but it really is for my parents who um, can't find the HDMI and the mode. So they couldn't run, you know, a media box and just have HDMI, you know, find their converter and another, or the converter, their remote control. Um, so what they end up doing is uh, they call me on the phone all the time asking me, why is their TV not work? So I mean, I'm trying to simplify things for them. This looks complex here, but for them really it's, it's uh, as simple as just having old analog cable because our cable company has gone and made it so that every TV in their house has to have a uh, 5 to $10 cable box and they don't want to pay that extra money. So they're just a nice little alternative, just creating some channels for them to watch. Um, for my brother, well, he'll probably have wrestling on it. And I'll use that device there. And for my mom, well, just for things that my mom would like to watch. Um, yeah, home videos. Yeah, sure. All right, cool. So I just wanted to show you my little setup. Mess of wires here. And the uh, channel vision. I didn't realize they had these things. And then when I bought one, it worked just the way I was hoping it would work. I guess you could stack these and if you really wanted to, make your own cable system for like a small area. I imagine hotels use these. Also, they used to use these things for apartment buildings where you'd have the cable and then you'd have the front door camera and you could put it on a cable channel that's uh, that was that's not being used. Anyway, I just find this device really neat and the applications for it, you could do lots of things with it. And the select channels also, you just gotta go here, up and down, select the channel, and then that's for channel A, I don't know if you can see the A, and then for B, you just select what you want there for B. Okay.